for being the number one corn producing state in the country, you would think Iowa would be the home of whiskey distilling. Yet this isn't the case, as Iowa's whiskey scene is still on the uprise. The pioneer for the state, Jeff Quint, owner of Cedar Ridge Distillery in Swisher, Iowa, is working to change the way people think about whiskey in the Midwest. You can see that we're milling grain every day and we're mashing every day and uh, we're actually making whiskey here. We're not just uh, selling whiskey here. But creating the push for whiskey in Iowa hasn't come without its difficulties. The longest licensed distillery in the state can't even sell its products on site. According to Iowa liquor licensing laws, the sale of hard alcohol is prohibited for distilleries, which sets back Iowa distilleries and their ability to compete with surrounding states. Legislation is definitely holding this industry back in a big way. Just because on-site sales aren't allowed doesn't mean that Cedar Ridge whiskey isn't being purchased. Iowa City restaurant Shorts, Burgers, and Shine sells Cedar Ridge products, including their very own whiskey distilled by Cedar Ridge, the Shorts Whiskey. Shorts employees say Cedar Ridge brand products are among some of their most popular whiskeys. I think they all do pretty well. Um, single malt uh, does really, really well. Uh, we use that in a couple of our cocktails. Cedar Ridge is definitely one of our main options that we, uh, we push. While Cedar Ridge will continue to distill, they will also keep fighting for a change in Iowa law that would allow them to sell their whiskey to Iowans.